Businesses never want to operate with unnecessary risk or complexity, yet many do every day because they rely on multiple disconnected scheduling and workload automation tools to manage the application workflows that support their critical business services. Companies often build homegrown solutions and manual scripts to try and bring it all together. But those tools can be difficult to manage, prone to break, and nearly impossible to scale. If you want to eliminate risk, increase agility, and reduce complexity, embracing a single application workflow orchestration platform is the way to get there. But that's easier said than done, right? Well, it's not as hard as you might think. Control-M and BMC Helix Control-M have built-in conversion tools designed to help you automate the conversion of your current workflows. In this video, we'll take a quick look at how they work. The conversion tool is easy to deploy and features a wizard interface that guides you through your conversion project step by step. There are four key steps, evaluation of your vendor data, conversion, validation, and loading your workflows to Control-M. At each step, you have complete control over migration progress and can make changes as needed. For this demo, I'm going to use sample data. When you work on your project, you will need to perform a preliminary step to extract data from your source vendor. In this case, you will create a new project, give it a name, select the vendor you are converting from, for example, Broadcom Autosys, and import data from the data files where you have extracted your vendor data. The instructions to extract your current vendor data are described in more detail in product documentation. Let's go back to our demo and let me walk you through the four steps. Let's use Dollar Universe as an example. The first step evaluates the input data, categorizes it, and sizes it by type. The reports it produces give you a first estimation of the conversion duration and effort required. The next step executes the conversion. It uses a predefined set of conversion rules that you can refine to better match your needs. For example, you can filter the type of data you want to convert in order to tackle the conversion in stages. The conversion results are provided in the form of messages and actions, which give you details on how much data was converted successfully and what data may require manual adjustment. Information about issues and recommended actions is also included. You can go back through the conversion and make updates until you are satisfied with the results. Next, in the validation step, you can view how the converted data is scheduled to run. You can filter on specific dates or objects and use the report you obtain to validate each entity. Finally, in the Load to Control-M step, you can import the converted data directly into Control-M. From here, you can use the verification tool and run comparisons between Control-M and your previous vendor's scheduler to make sure your business will run the same way, thus minimizing risk and downtime. You might be thinking, what if the workflow automation tool I want to convert isn't included in the list of out-of-the-box conversions? Control-M has a built-in self-conversion tool with an easy-to-use wizard that will guide you step-by-step -step through setting up your custom conversion. If you want additional support or someone to manage your entire conversion project, BMC's Customer Success Consulting Services Organization and Global Partner Network are also available. Want to learn more? Visit www dot bmc dot com forward slash control m